Good morning, class. Oh. So, good morning, Palan. So, please all stand for our prayer. Miss Maria, please lead us. Please lead the prayer. Amen. Okay, good morning once again. Kumusta? Kumusta ba po? Okay pa ba ta? Kumusta ba yung light? So, ang inyong hang house po, ang inyong hang house po, ang inyong hang house po, ang inyong Tarong ay yung mga screen. Yeah. Kung namin yung pamati, ay na lang po ha. Yeah. Hindi ba gawin mo kung namin yung pamati, ay na lang po ang sugar. And yeah. Um, keep us the peace of the church. Ang mga 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 Sir, my uh, reminder, hindi mo alam kung gawas ka. You can take your snacks inside the room. You can eat your snacks inside the room. Right? Pwede mo magawa. Okay, so let us review our topic uh, yesterday. So, Miss Kana, Miss Lunpopo. Okay, all right, that is good. So, our topic last yesterday is about hypothesis. Let's see. So, about the significance level, confidence level. Diba, mga natin yung historia sa hapon, no? Kung unsay ang um, asa na to i-reject o kung sa hypothesis testing. So it is a decision making whether you're going to reject or accept the not. Okay, so let us proceed now to our topic today. So what's the connection sa karong isa na last topic na to? But before that, so everybody get your tag words. Get your tag words. So, you're just going to decide whether the statement is correct or unclear. Number one, raise your tag words. Number one, Raya is a girl and she is wearing a tuxedo. Aksa, I mean, correct or unclear. Okay, very good. It is unclear. Number two, let's read everybody. All right, is it reject? Uh, I mean, correct or uh, unclear decision? Okay, very good. It is an error. Me, uh, Mr. Galon. Number three, please read. Okay, so reject or, uh, I mean, correct or an error. Kasama ko, sorry. So it is an error. Number four, all number added by one answers and odd number plus one plus four is equal to five. Error or correct decision. Very good. It is an error. Number five. He was persuaded to lie, but he instead tells the truth. Yes, what's your answer? Okay, it is a correct decision. Number six, the third point was set as free, and then I defend for it. What's your, what's your answer? Very good, it is a correct decision. Okay, ready na ba ta? So, ito ang topic ka ron. Okay, present your seatbelt. So, we're gonna fly into the world of... So, what is our topic for today? Okay, so our topic for today is all about correct type 1 and the type 2 error. Okay, so what's up is it correct si type 1 and si type 2 error? So can you see lang connection sa atong topics yesterday? Okay, so para masamsa, let us discuss about the our topic for today. Okay, let us analyze this. So type 1 error, kung may nang taong type 1 error, the true, the null hypothesis is true, but rejected. Kung may nang taong correct decision, the, the null hypothesis is true, but being accepted. That is correct decision. Kung may nang taong another correct decision, the null hypothesis is false and being rejected. Kung may nang type 2 error, the null hypothesis is false, but being so, what is the difference? Type 1 error, the truth is being rejected. Type 2 error, the false is being accepted. Ang hindi mo duma na ito kung may type 1 error, siya masakitan. Why? Ang hindi ang good part yung anay pero yung hindi reject. Kung may type 2 error, ikaw ang nasakitan. Ang hindi ang good part yung anay pero 
is being rejected and time to your post is being accepted. So, asa pa na ito ni ma-apply in reality? So, ma-apply din ito ito sa justice system. So, si justice system o si statistic hypothesis testing ng pagreko. So, yun nga na gaya ang pamaali ito sa justice system. Okay? So, na, the guilty is, the verdict is guilty, but innocent. So, that is type of error. O type of error, not guilty, but the defendant is guilty. That's what makes it type of error. So, an example para masagkat. Number one, a 20-year-old girl insists that she is a teen teenager. So what makes what makes it like what error? Because ang iyang tinuod na 20-year-old siya inang you reject. Iyang you reject ang fact na she is not uh, she is a 20-year-old already. So diba si 20-year-old is dili na teenager. So mao na true but being accepted. Number two, the boy who stole the money was judged innocent. So that the falsehood is being accepted. False ang ibuhat sa bata, pero di accept. Tumod ka, yung mong giling mo na, wala siya mga ala. Naklaro ang kalahian. Alright, right yun yung mga bata, aba. Okay, so task. So get your activity notebook. Okay, you're going to write down at least one example of correct decision. Type 1 error and type 2 error. Okay, I'll give you 10 minutes to answer. Uh, to write down your example. Okay? Okay, 10 minutes is kumalak. 10 minutes is uh, nakonsume na ninyo ang 10 minutes. So, okay. So, put, uh, let's move on to exercises. Okay. Try to answer that. So, yes, here, okay, you can also uh, You're just going to classify the decision, decision if it is correct. Type 1 or a type 2 error. Na? Uh, uh, ten minutes ang hapon ha? Okay, iba na. Alright, iba na. So, i-check na lang inyong hama si Bitty Notebook and then ibutang ninyo na sa ito ang statistics and probability, ba probability box. Kaya ko na ito, ito ha on after sa klase. Anong inyong mga mask? Yes, isipin ka na, tayo ka na. Okay, so this statement. Gusto ko inyong hama sulfing. Don't blame the lie that makes you comfortable. Instead, blame the truth that makes you uncomfortable. Ayaw ko no, i-blame ang but-but nga nahimutang comfortable. Kung di di, i-blame ko no ang truth na nahimutang uncomfortable. Isa na. Is it correct or an error decision? Okay, yes, Miss Charmaine. Oh, kisa may mo oppose sa decision na kung ano kuno. It is a uh, error decision. Yes, me uh Mr. Data. Okay, it is an error decision. So, how about this statement? Don't blame the truth that makes you uncomfortable. Instead, blame the lie that makes you comfortable. So, sa Bisaya pa, i blame kuno ang kamatuuran nga na himukang ang comfortable. Ay, ayaw i-blame ang kamatuuran nga na himukang dili comfortable. Kung dili, i-blame ang but-but nga na himukang comfortable. It is correct or an error decision? Yes, very good. It is a correct decision. So, naklaro ba? Questions our, about our topic for today? Clarification. Question. Okay, so I think uh, everybody is already understood about our topic or our discussion for today. Okay, so in your assignment, you're just going to research an example of a correct decision, type 1 error, and a type 2, type 2 error using the justice system. Okay? Okay, so let us all, uh, so that could be all, let us all stand for our prayer. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. So goodbye, class. Thank you and goodbye.